Hello, beer tubers, and welcome to another beer review with me, Peter the Master Papa. Today, joined by Just Michael. Reviewing some Bourbon County. I don't think I've reviewed a Bourbon County for, well, since the last time you and I reviewed one. <laughs> I'm the sure. provider of this shh beer. He's the provider of the county. Yep. Um, I'm not allowed to review this beer officially because it's macro beer. But <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. I really love this beer. No, it's they do their stuff pretty so, good. Compared to other macro breweries beers i mean this actually tastes good mm -hmm. it tastes it royal duner brew <laughs> yeah it does but i mean i yeah. kiss my i haven't touched this beer so it's <laughs> pretty good i assume but i mean it's it's not bourbon county is one of those beers that i think most beer geeks they look at it with a blind eye and drink it and accept that it's yeah. Indian and it's because it's just a great beer so yeah uh, this is a variation Last I reviewed was a 17 or 16. I don't vintage, remember. It's one of the first bottlings like this. We reviewed it together. Okay. I'm yeah. pretty sure. Yeah. I mean. um, but this here, guys, is the Bourbon County 2017 Northwoods edition. So they do like Northwoods. Uh, they do different do, varieties every year. There's like the Northwoods series, there's the Vanilla series, Priorities uh, edition. Proprietors. Proprietors. Edition. Edition. That's, Ton different this 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 year they did an orange chocolate edition yes. and a vanilla edition and different yeah. variations. Yeah. Uh, but this one is a well, Bourbon County Stout aged in bourbon barrels with blueberry juice and almond extract and dark chocolate. Or I think it's actually just yeah, it's just made with the, the blueberry juice and almond extract. I think dark chocolate is just the taste uh, of the of the base beer here because mm -hmm. it says aroma is a rich dark chocolate, fresh blueberry and nutty marzipan on the back. So this. Bottle here is 12.6% and yeah, from 2017, so over a year old. Yeah, it'll yep. be fun to see how it stacks up. It's, I mean, and it's always fun to drink Bourbon County. Yeah, it is. So, Pour is a... Thank you, Michael, for providing me this beer. Thank you, Michael, for yeah. sharing it. Well, it looks great in the glass. Pitch black color. It looks, yeah. Tan, slightly beige head on there. Nice head. Yeah, the, I mean... The small bottles in the... On the... Yeah, but it looks really good in the glass. It um, does. Let's try it and tell the aroma on the Northwoods 2017. Ooh. Ooh, very stinging bourbon character. Oh, still. marzipan. Yeah, really marzipan y. Yeah. Ooh, oh, my yeah. God. Really that straight good. marzipan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like stinging bourbon oh, character. Uh, also, oh, the, I get the blueberry the sweetness. I get some it's kind almost of. Almost as if like um, the Danish mm. confectionaries for Christmas, like a blueberry almond thing. Blueberry. Or marzipan. Like, no, no, but like almost like you did some kind of confectionery. Uh, Marzipan thing with blueberry as well. I, I'm thinking about the uh, the Antwerp. Marzipan ball. No, not a marzipan ball. But I think the plums in the Madeira. Oh yeah, yeah. They have oh. a blueberry vodka variant. <laughs> it tastes like it, it smells like. I can a, see that. I can see that. Like dark chocolate. It smells blueberry. amazing. The smell is amazing to me. I like but marzipan a lot, but this smells you, amazing. He's a marzipan freak. I'm a marzipan right guy. <laughs> It smells you're really, a, really you're good. You're a margin. I also have the brewery marzipan, the ammonium at home to taste, but I don't know. I love marzipan. Yeah. But I it, love uh, the cherry taste, the, the almond. Yeah. yeah. Uh, almost there's like a hint of dark cherry on it as well, actually. Oh, it smells awesome. The tobacco smoke as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, roasty, super You can roasty, smell the base beer too. Jarry oak. Loads if I should vanilla. rate the smell, it would get a hundred. I think really the smell is amazing. I don't. I wouldn't agree with it, but it, I no, think no, this, no. But it smells like a beer that opinion. would be right up your alley. Yeah, yeah, it does. Let's try it. Let's try it. Great. Cheers. Thanks for sharing, man. You're welcome. Mmm. Perfect temperature. Oh my god. Oh, that is so marzipan-y. It is. Holy crap! Good. You can taste the blueberry. You can taste the base beer. The blueberry. No, it's, it's just perfect. Yeah, Holy it is. Holy shit! What a Fuck ton of marzipan. This right now, my so palate good. is just like all marzipan and vanilla. But not not marzipan wow. like like on the um, the molen uh, uh, barley wine no, we no. had. This is so balanced with the mm. rest, and it has this jammy uh, this jammy blueberry. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I'm really also getting dark cherry. Um, mm. Wow, it's mm. so much vanilla. So much vanilla. Super roasty. Great mouthfeel. When I talk about Bourbon County barrel character in some beers, it's fun to revisit Bourbon County and just that, uh, yeah, that's what I see as the Bourbon <laughs> County character. <laughs> this is fucking good. I really, I, I bought this beer because I thought, yeah, well, the ratings is not 
the highest 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 but the, but, but the tasting notes was right up my alley and this is for me just amazing it tastes really, like dark really, really chocolate good. blueberry marzipan uh, marzipan raspberry or not raspberry uh, cherry dark cherry uh, it has the tobacco dark kind chocolate of, yeah, tobacco really dark tobacco leathery kind of flavors as well oh, big fuck. roast malt you're really i'm really excited about this one this is much better than i expected mm -hmm. well, the Whoa. thing is it's great that you went in with low expectations i, I went in with no expectations but, yeah but, but low expectation and you get a beer like this is always great Sometimes you buy a beer, actually, when you say you're not into rhubarb. I love rhubarb. And actually, recently I bought a beer, sour, with the rhubarb, because I really love the taste of rhubarb. But it's a mm. personal opinion. It's a personal preference. So, yeah. yeah. Really I thought the tasting notes on this one was right up my alley. And I was really, exactly I mean, we've right. had some really fucking good beers today, especially the dark ones. Yeah. A, a different stout, sour, mm. and smoked beer. But... Really love the barrel character on it. Sweet vanilla fudge, caramel. Is that sweet, sticky? The barrel is not burger. that the prominent. I think it is there for sure. It and is there, but it's, it's not, not as stand out as in a regular Bourbon County because you have so much marzipan flavor. I think. But you are really sad. I'm. I'm thinking. I'm, I'm actually thinking about a hundred. For me, I really, really love this beer. I couldn't. I would not I could, go that high. No, I know that, but I couldn't think of anything I would change about this. I really can. Well, if you if you feel like that, then you should definitely give it a hard. I, I mean, think I'm if about you feel like that's like like, like it's, if you feel like this, there's nothing I want to change, and you're as happy drinking it as you are now. Mm -hmm. That's like a hundreds experience. For me, I'm not at that level because well, I do love marzipan and one runs, but the flavors don't resonate with me in the same way. But I still think it's fucking amazing. My my initial thought was a ninety seven. I'm on hundreds. I think I think I'm on hundreds. Yeah, I am. If I had a bell, I would ring it. <laughs> this is fucking amazing. I love this beer. And I'm taking the rest of this one. <laughs> sure. I really love it. It's I really great. think this is fucking amazing. Yeah. Well, there you go. Yeah. A hundred and a ninety-seven. Yeah. Actually, well, not super far from each other. I, I think it's a world-class barrel of stout. But um, it, it's. I think I would actually rather drink the base, maybe. Nope, me neither. It no, it mean, I, I wouldn't. I but would rather the, have this the one. The one we have on the side, I think, is going to be pretty fucking crazy. Yeah, the vanilla one? Yeah. Yeah. Actually, That's going to wait a bit. Yeah, but but, but the but, 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 thing is good. But the one we had, uh, like back in the day, that original vanilla from County was available in Denmark. Okay. And it was sitting on shelves because people didn't want to pay 120 crowns for a bottle of... <laughs> That's <laughs> this sounds I reviewed it with Jacob yeah. back in the day. I loved it. So it's fun. And they all, I know they also did a rye version. But yeah, I, 97. I think it's fucking great. It's awesome. Yeah, yeah it is. The hundreds for you. A hundreds for me. Good. So the, I think the first time. Wild. I think this is the first time you Yeah, get I think it's the first time I get a hundreds. But I'm not in doubt. This one is uh, fucking amazing. Right up my alley. Yeah. We should get you a Bourbon County shirt. Does we anyone should get a Bourbon County. I would love to have a Bourbon County glass. But I'm not sure. Anyone out there? Shh. This is a beer I shouldn't be promoting. I'm sorry. <laughs> but it's fucking great, this one. It is. You know, I have to be honest. I mean, he's got a red cap on. It actually originally said Budweiser, but he took it off. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is great. I mean, yeah, 9700. Yeah. This is great stuff. If you guys had a chance to try the 2017 North, Northwoods Bourbon County, Bourbon County with uh, blueberry juice and almond extract, let us know what you thought of it. Damn good stuff. Worth a shot for sure. If you have one in your cellar, crack it now. I bet there was even more blueberry for it when it was fresh. Uh, Probably. This um, is fucking but, good balance, so... Yeah, yeah, it's great. So, yeah, if you guys have a chance to try it, let us know. And as always, remember to comment, subscribe, check out the Facebook fan page, Twitter, and Instagram. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And we're going to say cheers to some delicious bourbon barrel-aged crazy stuff. And see you guys in another video. Sure.